I'm going to unbox some of the items that I purchased from Hermes in Paris this time. I'll share their price in Paris Euro and also share their price in the USD as well so that you can see the price differences. In the end of the video, I also calculated the total spending for this time. Don't forget to leave me a comment down below to let me know what do you think of my new purchases and which one is your favorite. Let's get right into the video. Let's start with the first item here. You may be able to guess what the item is just based on how much you know Hermes and the size of this bag. It's actually a Hermes belt. It has this bridge bell buckle. This buckle, really just like its name, it's in the palladium plated metal. So the width of the belt is 38 millimeter. The belt and the buckle are sold separately. The buckle cannot be sold alone, but you can buy as many as the belt, the band as you wish to match your belt buckle. So one side of the belt is in the noir color and the other side of the belt is in the etain color. It's actually a man's belt and the hubby loved the look of the belt so we pick it up this time. I just thought to myself that if you want to max out the value of this belt, what you could do is actually, it looks pretty good on women as well. So what you can do is find a place that can punch more holes for you and you buy a belt for hubby and then both of you are able to wear this belt to max out the value. The buckle itself is 355 euro and the belt itself is 430 euro. The total of the belt is is 785 euro and I look at the price here in the US and the, the buckle and the belt is $1,005 plus tax which means that the euro price is cheaper. The next item doesn't have a box it comes with this bag so I just open it and this is actually one of the item I tried on in one of my Hermes shopping vlog and you may already guess it's in this plastic bag. It is basically the reversible long sleeve sweater in the beige color. It's a new style from the spring summer 23 ready to wear collection from Hermes and this one is in the size 34 which is my normal size. So I would say it's true to size. This one is also available in the navy color. I didn't see any navy color available in the boutique and there's no sizes available. Even this one in the beige color is literally the last one in the last size that is available so I was very very lucky to be able to find this one. The sweater makes 60% of cashmere and 35% cotton. The collar, cuff, bottom all have the rib trim. I love the fact that, that it's double sided and you can see this side is the plain side and the, the other side is the fancy side full of the H motif. If you want a bolder look Either way, it's a really comfortable piece with casual feel and definitely perfect for everyday wear and I can see myself wear very often. Exactly what I was looking for, I'm really happy with it. If I am paying for this kind of price for a ready to wear piece like this, I better wear it very often to max out the value, right? I only have one reminder. If any of you are getting a double sided sweater from Hermes and you know that you're supposed to wear both sides so you must cut these tags, right? I just want to remind you that when you cut these tags off, definitely be careful. If you think you can just use scissor to lift the thread up, it might cut your sweater. And definitely make sure you cut a bit more like onto the tag piece so that it won't ruin your sweater. So this sweater is 2,450 euro in Paris when I got it and I couldn't find a price in the US but based on how much I know Hermes is pricing and I know this one's gonna be more expensive in the US and if anyone bought it in the US Feel free to share the price down below with a comment so all of us can see it as well. The next item also comes in this kind of packaging and I have already worn it when I was in Paris. Yep, so this is my new hat 
from Hermes. It's our 100% cashmere Serena baseball cap with the patch in the middle. The back has two adjustable tab with two polished palladium plated buckle. So the lining is in silk. I don't know if you can see those H motifs inside of the lining, which is really, really nice. And also the patch in the front here is in the 100% calf skin. I was looking for a cap like this in San Francisco, but I never able to find it in my size. And I got this one in size 57 and I just wear it as is with the two buckles snap on and it fits me perfectly. I really like the sheet color of this baseball cap and I have already worn it and this color really goes with everything. So this baseball cap is 440 euro in Paris and the same cap is 560 plus tax in the US. So you can tell that the US price is higher too. The next item, if you watched my Christmas wish list video right before the trip I went to Paris, this is actually one of the items. I literally showed a picture of it online and I couldn't believe I was able to find it and I was really happy about that. It's basically the Serena Bryce the Gala baseball cap. It's also in the 100% cashmere material. I got it in the size 57. I think this cap is a little smaller than the other one because I can only snap on one in the back and this fits me perfectly. It has the Bryce the Gala embroidery which I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with already. The lining is also in silk and you may be able to see the H motif here and also Bryce the Gala embroidery in the middle of the cap. It's just a really cool and stylish stamen baseball cap and this baseball cap will elevate your style immediately and brighten up your entire look kind of like this and make you look more stylish. It is exactly what I was looking for. So this baseball cap price is 690 euro when I bought it in Paris and it's currently retail for $870 plus tax in the US. The next item is just way too cute and if you watched my Christmas wish list video right before my trip, you will probably already seen that item and it was really really not easy to get in Paris this time. If you think Paris has more stock for everything, that is not true. Basically the popular items in Paris, the stock situation is pretty much same as how it is in the US. It's really really difficult to get this item. So I was super lucky and I'll definitely share all the details how I was able to get it in my upcoming Hermes shopping experience video but for now I'll just show you what it is first. It is something that I put it on the wish list in San Francisco but I was never able to get one so definitely really excited to use this item. You ready? Ta-da! <laughs> So it is my constant slim wallet in the Epson leather, rose gold hardware, Noa color. My goodness, I just have to say Epson leather on the constant slim just looks so nice and so perfect. For those of you who know me, black is probably not the color on my list, but you know what? Since it's so hard to get, also Black is such a classic color that I can't just go wrong with. I'm just really happy to get it. Back of the slim wallet has a belt loop for you to wear it as a belt bag. And then you can open it up from the flap and then this is opened. This is the felt cloth come with it. Inside of this constant slim wallet, it has a removable zip the change purse. It does has the H details in the zipper and here, this is how you open it. It just said Hermes Paris made in France and then you can put your cards or anything else in there. And then inside of this constant slim here, you can see there's two pocket, one pocket in the front and the one pocket for another card in the back. Inside of here is the delicate lambskin and I'm sure it will get scratched over time after I use it. But it feels really nice though. And rose gold hardware is just such a beautiful combo and make the black color even more special. So the Constant Slim Wallet measures 4.9 inches wide, 
4 inches high, 1.2 inches deep if any of you are interested. It is a small leather goods but you can totally wear it as a handbag and there's so many different ways that you can do it. It's a super cute micro mini bag although it can hold a lot of stuff. I just think it's something that I want to have fun with. Definitely stay tuned for another video that I will show you all these different ways that you can rock this micro bag if you are interested in it as well. In the purse, the price is 2,110 euro when I bought it and the Constant Slim is currently retail for $2,675 plus tax in the US. So there are definitely quite some savings, especially if you count the tax. So I calculate the price. The belt and the sweater and two baseball cap are 4,365 euro and the Constant Slim is 2,110 euro. So the total spending for this unboxing is 6,475 euro. Which one is your favorite from my Hermes haul this time? Definitely leave me a comment down below to let me know. I also have two Hermes bags that I want to unbox it with you guys. They deserve a dedicated unboxing videos of their own. So definitely stay tuned and I'll see you soon. Bye bye!